Well, hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. As some of you know that watched, I think it was called my life update video, I will link it up in a card for you guys if you haven't watched it yet. I now have a new job. I go there Monday through Friday and I have my own desk and my own area and I really wanted to make some of that my own. So today I'm gonna to be showing you all of the things that I have purchased for my new office. Full disclosure, I did partner with Erin Condren on this video and some of the items that you are gonna see are provided by them in PR. So thank you so much to the Erin Condren team for reaching out and providing me with some of these items today. So as a lot of you know that work outside of your home, you kinda wanna make your office your own space. So these are just kinda the things that make me feel comfortable and if you guys feel comfortable with other things or have other great ideas, leave them down in the comments because I would love that place to be a place where we can just kind of share what we do in our spaces away from home that kind of make it more us. So first things first, I don't have a ton of wall space, but I did manage to snag one of these bad boys, which is the new calendars. These are the wall calendars and they're like, I don't know, I need to open them up. They're like, all nicely packaged like this, isn't that cool? Um, and they have the little date dots on them, which I think is super snazzy. So if you do get them in like the middle of the year and you wanna start them now, you totally can. But I believe these are like the, I think they're called the reversible um, ones. So on the back side, there's like a quote. Yes, so there is a quote. So it's basically just a piece of like board. Kind of, it's very thick. But um, I have enough wall space for these and I will start mine in January. I do have another calendar already that I'm currently using, um, but yeah, I just thought that these would be great. And they came with a set of date dots as well. I didn't know that, so I actually put them in my cart. So now I have two sets of date dots just in case I mess up, so, um, but that's awesome. Yeah, this is called the reversible quote calendar. Um, but this is gonna be great because I have to deal with calendars all day at my office, so it's very exciting. And here's the other date dots that I put in the cart, but whoopsie dupsie, that's all right. And to go along with my calendar, I actually got some of these. I love these dual tip markers. Um, these are the black, white, and red, or sorry, black, white, and red, black, blue, and red. And then I got the highlighting ones as well, which are the pink, orange, and yellow. I just thought that these would be great on the calendar or just in my normal, you know, writing, because I write a lot at the office. I did also get some of these stylized, I think they're called stylized sticky notes. Is that what they're called? Yeah, Snap-in Stylized Sticky Notes. Um, I got the Woven Wonder pattern as well as the teacher snap-in ones because these ones are more kind of like, I don't know, they seem more office-y to me. Um, it says like today, note to self, memo, and then it's got like little, um, what am I trying to say, pencil. Words are hard today. <laughs> um, I do have some notebooks that I will show you in a little bit, but these would be great for like taking notes or things I might wanna mark, or even I thought these would be great for some of the calendar pages that I'm maybe not sure of certain dates just to kind of mark something in on a sticky note and just to put it on there. And then once I get dates confirmed or times confirmed, then I can write it in in pen. But I absolutely love these. And if you guys watch my plan with me is which I will link a card up there for you guys if you're interested. I use the snot out of these ones all the time in my hourly. So I absolutely love these ones, but you know, I had to get both because why not, right? Also, I thought a great idea for the calendar also to go along with that would be these three sticker sheets. They're all the same, but what I thought I would do is because like they have lots of, sorry about the glare you guys. Um, they have lots of different columns of the different colors of the months that kind of correlate to it. So it's got like a money sign and like a bunch of different icons, but I thought I would put the money sign in on the days that we get paid and we get paid every other Friday. So some of the months we do get paid three times. So I figured I would get three of these. And then also um, because I would want the, you know, 
color to coordinate with the month, if that makes sense. And then also there's like happy birthdays, celebrate to do and reminders and other things like that. So um, there's lots of people in my office. So I figure I might do like a happy birthday or something like that um, for some of the people that I work pretty closely with. So yeah, but anyway, I just thought these were really cute and um, they're foiled in all the different foily guys. And if you guys get Erin Condren life planners, I believe that this is the sheet in the back of the life planner, or at least it has been in years past. So um, it's just sort of a really nice coordinated sheet to have if you want to have like icons and stuff. Speaking of icons, I also picked up this. This is the A plus, A plus style sticker pad. Wow, I can't say that today. Um, and this is like meant for the teacher stuff, but I thought for offices it would be great. Let me open it up and I'll kind of show you uh, what's inside. So it's a 16 page booklet and there's over a thousand stickers in here. So this is like right up my alley at the office. So it's got like time to prep, measurement stuff i deal with measurements all day and then also like binder clips and paper clips and pencils i deal with those all day as well and then um this stuff says like time to grade no school i wouldn't use those just because of you know i don't i don't have that in my normal daily life but that's all right and then also there are some other different kind of like headers and stuff that i could use these have apples on them but it doesn't bother me um and then i could you know, these have some stars, which are great. And then like meetings, I go to a lot of meetings. Um, and then also I could put in like my times of day. My office, my current office has like a flex schedule. So you don't have to come in at any specific time. So if you wanna be there at 6.45, you can. If you wanna be there at 9.45, you can. So it's just kind of like whatever works for you as long as you're getting uh, your hours in and your work done. So um, this would be great to kind of track my week of what I'm actually, you know, where I'm, where I'm at or whatever. And then there's also these, which are some great little pages that are stickers. And then these are kind of some blank ones, but they have like, so busy, uh, you got this. I needed that, you got this the other week. <laughs> and then there's some kind of quote stickers, which I probably wouldn't use in the workplace, but that's all right. And then we've got some like long strips. And then there's a bunch of apples that I probably wouldn't use. Um, I might actually use that in my meal tracker, which I will talk about in a later video coming up sometime in the future, I'm not sure when. Um, but then it's got these little like teardrops, which I think would be nice. And then this just has different days of the week, it looks like, yeah. And then, yeah, just a bunch of icons and then just some letters and numbers and then more letters and numbers. So I thought that this would be great for the office just because it's more office centric, I feel like, but I don't know. I just really liked it and I thought that it would look really, really cute in some of my other things. All right, on to the next thing. The next thing I decided to get was this designer sticker book, the classic collection edition four. This is the new one for this year that has kind of the woven wonder pattern and I will open it for y'all even though I, Pretty sure I've shown this in several videos already and I've used it in plan with me's and stuff. But um, yay, it's so cute. There's so much like good stuff in here. I'm sorry, I'm like, I could have never like been a reader at schools because I feel like doo -doo 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 -doo, reading it and like not paying attention um, and not like showing the kids in the class the picture book. <laughs> but yeah, this has some great stuff in it. I love that it's got a lot of functional things in there. There's a couple of little things like these little hearts and stuff. There's like a couple of little like decorative elements, but I just love how functional it is. You can kind of make it your own. Um, so yeah, but anyway. This is this book, which I think will go really nicely with all the other elements that I got. And then I got a blanket. I know that sounds a little nuts, but I got a blanket for the office and I did get the star pattern. And um, I believe that this color was like called camel or something. I don't know. It's a little bit uh, more of a yellowy tone, but I really, really like it. Um, this is gonna go on the chair that I sit on. What ends up happening in my office, it's like still all folded up from 
the post office, <laughs> but I'm just gonna uh, wash this up this weekend and then bring it to work. So what happens in our office is it's kind of attached to our warehouse and it gets really, really hot in there. So they tend to use the air conditioning basically all year round. And I know a lot of people's offices get really, really cold all the time. So a lot of the other people have like little lamp blankets and stuff. So that is gonna be my lamp blanket. Um, but I'm just gonna fold it over my chair on a normal basis. And then if it gets too cold, I'll just put the lamp blanket on and go for it. Also, some other things that I have brought to work or bringing to work is one of my number one favorite and I kind of need some right now. Um, this is hand food. This is by Soap and Glory. Yeah, Soap and Glory. I get mine at Target, but you can get it on like Amazon or something. I touch paper all darn day at work and it is so drying on my hands and my hands are like kind of cracking a little bit because it's that time of year right now as well. So I always like to have a good hand lotion at work. And um, you know, every time you go to the bathroom and you wash your hands, it's like, oh, my hands are dry. So I need, I need more moisture in my life. Um, okay, also, this is one of my favorite things, Mentos gum. Um, I don't know, I'm just a fan of like, the plastic large pack of gum. I don't know about you guys, but every time I get like the small pack, I feel like I run out way too fast. So I always just wanna get the large pack. And I don't know, this one's sugar-free Ventos, pure fresh spearmint, I don't know. I just get whatever. Um, I'm, I do like cinnamon, but I'm not a fan of cinnamon like in the workplace. I just wanna feel like minty like more minty and fresh in my breath after i have like maybe a garlicky something for lunch so um i just don't really want cinnamon then but i like cinnamon i just don't like it then also i decided to bring my awesome i think this is awesome my pill organizer i will leave a video down below um when i organize this so i've got my advil tylenol tums Ocilium, cough drops, Dayquil, and then non-drowsy cold and cough. Um, I did check with HR and they are okay with me having all of this stuff in my desk. So um, definitely check with your HR if they are okay. And this is all over the counter stuff, but um, just in case they ever had any questions as to what it was, cause I'm clearly gonna keep it in my desk. Um, but yeah, so I've actually had to use a couple of Advil and um, I've had a coworker use, I think a Tylenol already out of this, but, um, but yeah, that's been great. And I think that that's awesome because then you don't have to like kind of suffer all day. And if you can just kind of, nip your issue at like 10 a.m. versus waiting all day or waiting till lunch and then having to go somewhere and spend money, you know, why wouldn't you do that? Um, also, this is a pouch from the last, yeah, the fall seasonal surprise box from erincondren.com. This is kind of a maroon color and has like the little asterisks on the side. And I was like, you know what? This color isn't like that bad. I kind of, enjoy the pouch but i didn't know what i wanted to use it for so what i ended up using it for and this was like an exclusive for the seasonal surprise box they don't have this particular color on the website however they do have several other colors on their website um this one was lined and it's going to be kind of hard to see but it was lined with the um I don't know, like the peacock feathers. But what I decided to do with this is have this kind of be like my feminine hygiene area. And sorry if it's TMI, but guess what? We all menstruate at some point or another, uh, if you're female for the most part. I'm sure there's medical mysteries out there why people don't, but anyway. So there are some tampons in here. Oh, I gotta load up on some tampons. I only have a couple. And then I've got like some pads and some liners. So if I need something or a coworker needs something, I have a bag of stuff just sitting in my desk and it's available for everybody. And a lot of the ladies around me, I already told them, hey, this is what this is. If you need it and I'm not here or whatever, like feel free to go into my desk and grab a tampon or a pad or whatever you need. Like no need to replace it, it's fine. I mean, don't depend on this like for your normal daily use, but if for some reason you forgot a tampon or a pad or something in your purse, feel free. Like I've been there, so I would just hope that other people would be like <laughs> nice and share, you know? I also got some notebooks. This is what I was talking about when I was talking about those little clip-in things, which are over here. Whoa, about to drop stuff. <laughs> 
So yeah, these, these little clip-in little guys right here. This could go on here, no problem. I do have two separate notebooks. So I got the star pattern as well as, that kind of matches my blanket. And then I also got um, this pattern as well. And um, this pattern uh, kind of bothers me a little bit, but I do like this pattern in the foil for some reason. Oh, Doyle's coming downstairs now. <laughs> So um, this one is just my regular notebook that I take to meetings and things like that. If you can see on the bottom, it says what my title is. Um, I am a process engineer. So um, yeah, but I absolutely love this. I think it's really cool. These are the larger versions. I can't remember off the top of my head what the sizes are, but this is the larger version. These are all the notes that I've been taking um, for my job as to how to put things into the computer and like little notes to myself that maybe I wouldn't remember so this says notes and then it says process engineer on it and it also has that star pattern um, and I believe this is not the black but I think this is the charcoal version if I remember right and I got both of the notebooks I'm not going to show you my notes because that's like a little TMI but I got both of the notebooks in the lined version I believe that you can get them in the lined the dot grid and maybe the productivity, but I know the line in the dot grid you can get um, for sure. But yeah, absolutely love this and these are really nice. Oh, and then in the back of these, just to let you know, um, there are lots and lots of stickers and they're like a flag, it's hard to tell. Let's see if we can like peel one off together so you can kind of see the outline of what it looks like. That's oh, gonna be hard to see. See, that's kind of what it looks like. See, I'm bad at show and tell y'all. <laughs> so if I do want to put something specific in a day or whatever, I can do that. I'm trying to save the sticker. It's probably not going to work out. <laughs> eh, it probably didn't work out so well, but that's okay. <laughs> but yeah, I've been using the snot out of this because I'm still learning on how to do my job because I've only been there for a couple of months now. But um, yeah, I am filling this bad boy up front and back and I am already probably about a quarter of the way through my pages, so yeah. But that is it for my haul and sharing what I am bringing to my office to make it a more comfortable place for me to work on a normal daily basis. Like I said before, if you guys have certain things that you bring into your office to make it you know, more homey or to make yourself more comfortable, please let me know in the comments down below. I didn't really talk about like food or snacks or anything like that in this video because I feel like that's just a little bit more individualized but if you have like favorite snacks on the go or like other things like let me know in the comments I'd be really curious to know what you guys like in your office so I am gonna jet I will leave links to all the places that I got all the things down below for you guys again thank you so much to Erin Condren and her team for providing some of the items that you guys saw today if you like this video make sure to give it a thumbs up feel free to subscribe if you'd like to see more if you have any video ideas you know the drill put them down below and I will see y'all in the next video bye guys well folks it's time to kick it old school uh, so you